Hello, and welcome to Vero Software's YouTube videos on using Cabinet Vision. In this video, we will be going over how easy it is to create a job. To start off, we can select one of three options to create a job. We can either open the application menu and click on the New command. We can also use the New button in the Quick Access Toolbar. Or we can press the Control and N keys on our keyboard. The second step to creating a job is setting the job properties. These are the defaults the Cabinet Vision will use to set up assembly construction, job information, material schedules, and more. Before we go any further, let's change the job number to YouTube and the job description to YouTube Sample Job. Now, I could go ahead and change other properties for this job, but I'm just going to accept the defaults that are already set by clicking the OK button. And there we have it, a new job ready for us to begin. Now, I like to save the job before I go any further. Now, just like with creating the job, there is more than a couple of ways we can do this. The first is to open the application menu and select Save or Save As. We can also click on the Save button in the Quick Access Toolbar. Or we can press the Control and S keys on our keyboard. This displayed the Windows Save File dialog. We can use this to save our job to a specific location. Now, if you recall, we set the job name to YouTube. Cabinet Vision automatically set the name of the file it wants to create to that job name. At this point, we can navigate to another folder or change the name of the file. But I'm just going to click the Save button to save the file in the default location using our job name so I can easily find the job at a later time. Okay, so that pretty much covers job creation. Just for the heck of it, let's see how easy it is to open an existing job as well. First, we need to close the job. We can do this by opening the application menu and clicking the close command. To see the options we have for opening the job, let's open the application menu. You can see that my recent file list has the YouTube job in it, so I can click here to open that job. I can also click the open command to open the job. And of course, I can press the Control and O keys on my keyboard. All I have to do now is select the job file I want to open, in this case the youtube.cvj file, and click the open button. And that pretty much does it for job creation. In the next video, we will go over how easy it is to set up walls of various types, as well as creating new rooms.